James Wan, this James, the wine guy, I love red Austrian wines. And I have a Blau Frankisch next ahead in this review. Stay tuned. Love, love, love Austrian red wines. I think for me, it is an exemplary uh, experience where I think I'm tasting uh, a bit of the cuisine style in terms of what does this pair with. And I'm just imagining the cuisines that this is going to pair with. Uh, really beautiful pork dishes, beef dishes, salmon, uh, red sauce dishes, and a variety of spicing such as paprika. Uh, for me, I think this is an absolutely beautiful wine where, uh, first of all, let me introduce this wine. It so right here we have Mür van der Nieuwpoort and uh, Blau Frankisch, of course. This wine is called Zant und Seide, and that means velvet and silk in German. Uh, very low ABV at 13.5%, 2012 vintage. And back label for your review right here. I, I just delight in this wine. I think it's just so expressive and beautiful and very much that homage to Blau Frankisch, also known as Lamberger, uh, in terms of, say, you find this wine variety here in the United States, but mainly it's going to be in Austria. Uh, Czech Republic, and in that general region in uh, Europe, you're going to find a lot of Blau Frankisch. It is just really uh, absolutely stunningly gorgeous. So, first the point score. This is 94 points out of 100 points, and uh, or 9.4 out of my 10.0 scope. So in this, I'm getting notes of uh, blueberry, blackberry, cherry, game, mushroom, and uh, dense forest. And next, the flavor characterization. Notes include cherry, strawberry, tayberry, hint of pepper, bay leaf, and lavender. And I'm going to compare and contrast against the scent characterization. I'm getting a lot of blueberry, blackberry notes. So on the flavor to scent characterization, I'm getting a different experience altogether. Scent characterization, I'm getting the blueberry, the blackberry notes. But on the flavor characteristics, I'm getting cherry, strawberry, and tayberry notes. And um, that's the beauty of wine. That's the complexity of wine. And I really, really love that. So again, 94 points out of 100 points. And uh, being on this racetrack, it is Austria. It's really to think about regions that I rarely ever taste from, actually. I'm going to be visiting Austria this year, so I'm very excited about that. Unfortunately, I won't get enough experience in the wine country in Austria, uh, but I will at least be in Vienna to taste wines and have a wine opportunity uh, that I wouldn't have any other place except in Austria. Thank you for your support. Questions and comments can be listed down below, and I'll put more information on the U.S. importer as well as a producer. And uh, please uh, give a like, share this video on your favorite social media such as Facebook, Twitter, Google+, Pinterest, LinkedIn, as well as Instagram and WordPress. So stay tuned for more video wine content to come. Thank you for your support again. Salut!